So you wanna get abs, whether that be a four pack, a six pack, an eight pack, regardless of what it is, in today's video, I'll tell you guys how you can get abs extremely fast and stick around to the end of the video because I'll give you guys some super simple exercises that if you do, I promise and guarantee that your abs will be poking you out and you'll finally have that six pack washerboard abs that you've always wanted. So stick around to the very end. Before we get into those, I'm just gonna break down basically like the science and the anatomy of abs. So the first thing that you wanna know that if you actually wanna get abs for yourself, the best, quickest, most efficient way to do that is to just lose weight. Most guys, you're not at a low enough body fat percentage to where your abs can actually poke through. Now, everybody has abs. I don't know if you guys knew that, but we all have abdominals, but a lot of times you just don't see them because there's too much of a layer of fat in your abdominal stomach area to where you don't actually see them. So if you wanted to get abs, honestly, the best way would be just to lose weight. I'll put up a picture on the screen. It was also the thumbnail, but this is what I looked like after fasting for a few days. And a lot of times just by getting to a lower body fat percentage without even working out, your abs will pop through. So that's the number one way for you to get abs, guys. Just lose weight and lower your body fat percentage. I don't know if you guys can see right now, the lighting is a little bit iffy, but I'm at an 11% body fat percentage and my abs do show through like pretty good. So now let's get into the anatomy of it. So there are three parts to your abs. There are the upper abdominals, there are the lower abdominals, and there are the obliques, which are like the side parts of your abs. So you wanna be working out and exercising all three of these muscle groups to make it where you have a full set of abs. Now you'll probably notice most people, most guys have at least a two pack or four pack. That's like the top two abs protruding or the top four abs protruding, but it's really hard for guys to get a six pack. Even for me, I noticed that getting like those last uh, two, technically we all have eight packs, but I don't really count that. So getting the last two for the six pack is really hard for a lot of guys because a lot of times most guys don't know how to work out their lower abdominals. Now there are exercises that correspond to each of these ab muscle groups that you can work out and do to actually make sure you strengthen those core muscles to where they'll pop through your stomach area. Now to get your top four abs to poke through and protrude, there are these things called bottom down exercises. So think of things like sit-ups, crunches, anything that you do where you're like you're kind of going down from your upper portion of your body, those are top down exercises. Now to get your lower two abs to protrude, you have to do things called bottom up exercises. So these are things like leg lifts, anything that where you're bringing the bottom part portion of your body upwards, that's what's gonna work those lower abdominals. And then for obliques, you can probably guess it, you just have to do exercises where you're moving to the side. So I actually prefer bottom up exercises because again, most guys already have a two to a four pack. So it's just about strengthening those lower abdominals to make sure and make you give like that full six pack ab look. All right, so since you guys stuck around this long in the video, I'm gonna give you guys some exercises you can do to work out each of those groups of the abs that I just previously mentioned. I'll put some videos up on the screen so you guys can see. But the first exercise that you're gonna wanna do, which I believe is really important, is the ob oblique side bends. So these are to work your obliques, you'll see on the screen right now. But basically you just wanna have a weight, literally hold it in one arm and lean down and just lift it back up. That's the thing about exercises, guys. It's so simple, so easy. Uh, these are almost like caveman style exercises. Just man lifts weight, and then puts it back down. And these are gonna work your obliques. Next up, these are gonna be the top down exercises. So this one's super simple, guys. It's just a weighted decline sit up. Again, I'll put it on the screen right now. You'll see me doing them, but you're just gonna wanna be in a decline bench, guys. You'll find it at your gym. Put a weight, I'll usually start off with like anywhere from five to 10 pounds. Put it over your chest and then just do a crunch or a sit up up. Again, super simple, guys but these are better than just regular sit-ups and crunches because you have that weight. And then by being on a decline bench, you have a fuller range of motion. These are really good for your top two to four abs. Now, last but not least, the most important exercises in my opinion, these are the bottom up exercises. So the first one is gonna be a seated ab leg raise. So you can do these on the floor. I like to do them on a bench. You'll see in the video I put on the screen right now, but literally you're just gonna take your legs 
you're gonna kind of curl up, keep your upper back on the bench, take your legs and you just swing them up above your head. Now make sure that you're moving from your core, don't use momentum on this exercise, but these are really good for developing your bottom two and your six pack. And then the last exercise, also a bottom up exercise to work your lower two abs and your lower abs, is gonna be a hanging ab leg raise. Now with these, you're just gonna hang from a bar and then literally just take your legs and lift them up towards your chest. Uh, there are many iterations of this. You'll see the ones I'm doing on screen right now, but do it to where you feel comfortable and then where you're not gonna injure yourself. So make sure you're not feeling any strain in your back area and your lower back area. Again, don't use momentum. Just really focus on using your core area to lift your legs up. Guys, this is just how you go about getting abs quick. Um, if you guys want a version of this video at home so you can do it literally from the comfort of your own home and you don't have to go to the gym, comment down below and I'll make that video after this one. But yeah, just a super quick video how to develop abs fast. If you do this, literally I guarantee within like a week you guys will have some type of result. If you like today's video, make sure you give it a thumbs up, hit the subscribe button and turn on post notifications because I do post videos like this every single day. And if this video resonated with you, check out this video about how getting checked will change your life. I love you guys and I'll speak with you very soon. I'll see you tomorrow.